Hello, my name is Miguel Rincon, and I am going to give a quick demo of our new runner workflow process. Uh, I'm going to show you how we are able to register a runner right now from the admin page. And this is a new feature that we are going to release shortly. Uh, so first of all, uh, I have to make sure that the right feature flag is enabled. Uh, so I'm going to uh, just uh, type this into my Rails console to ensure that we are uh, working. And as you can see, uh, I have enabled this feature flag already. Now, uh, I'm going to download the, the latest uh, runner package. Uh, this package has the uh, already accounts for the new registration process. It's not yet available uh, to everybody, so I have to download it from the uh, main branch. I'm going to uh, start the download over here. And we're almost done. And I'm going to prepare the next command that ensures that I can execute the GitLab runner myself. And I'm going to install it in my machine. OK, so now that uh, I have the latest, the very latest runner version installed, I'm able to follow the creation instructions in the admin runners page. Uh, that I have in my development environment. I'm going to uh, create a new instance runner. I'll select the macOS instructions and create my new runner. I don't need to choose any specific configuration. Uh, just have it. I'll just have it set to run on tag jobs because I will not be setting any tags. And I'm going to submit. Okay, now that I have submitted, I get the instructions to register this new runner onto my instance with the new registration token. I'm going to uh, type dot and slash before because that's where my actual runner executable is. And then I'm going to run the registration. It will confirm that the GitLab instance URL and the registration token are correct. And then it will prompt me to select an executor, just as the instructions uh, uh, say. So I'm going to select a shell. And now I can see that the runner has been verified. As a next step, I will be able to test if the runner is actually picking up jobs. So I'm going to clear the screen. And I'm going to select run. I should see some feedback about my new runner. OK, and now I see that the new runner has been created. If I visit the runners page, I should see my new runner online. OK, and uh, I can see its version. I can see it has been uh, created just now. And in the future, we will be able to see who created it as well. Thank you very much.